You're here because the universe wanted you to watch this video. What I will now teach you about the heart and its actual power has the potential to improve every aspect of your life. Stay till the end of the video. In the realm of spirituality and personal growth, the heart has long been revered as a source of wisdom, compassion, and inner truth. Ancient traditions and mystical teachings have spoken of the heart as a gateway to the divine, a center of intuition and higher consciousness. But what if I told you that modern science is now confirming what the sages and seers have known all along? That the heart is not just a metaphorical symbol of love and wisdom, but a literal powerhouse of energy and intelligence far surpassing the capabilities of the brain. I'll tell you about the cutting-edge research of the HeartMath Institute, which has revealed that the heart generates an electromagnetic field up to 60 times more powerful than that of the brain. We'll explore the profound implications of this discovery for our personal and collective well-being, and I'll teach you practical techniques for harnessing the heart's incredible power to transform our lives and the world around us. For centuries, the brain has been regarded as the supreme organ of the human body, the master controller of all our thoughts, feelings and actions. But what if we've been overlooking the true powerhouse of our being, the very center of our intelligence and vitality? Enter the HeartMath Institute, a pioneering research organization dedicated to exploring the science of the heart and its role in human performance, emotional well-being and global coherence. Through decades of rigorous study and experimentation, the HeartMath team has made a series of groundbreaking discoveries that are revolutionizing our understanding of the heart's true potential. One of the most astounding findings to emerge from this research is the fact that the heart generates an electromagnetic field that is up to 60 times more powerful than that of the brain. This field, which can be measured using sensitive scientific instruments, extends far beyond the physical body, interacting with and influencing the fields of those around us. To put this into perspective, imagine you're walking into a room filled with people. Even before you speak a word or make eye contact, your heart's electromagnetic field is already communicating with the fields of those around you, exchanging information and influencing the emotional tone of the space. This is why we can often sense the vibe of a room or the mood of a person without any verbal cues. Our hearts are constantly reading and responding to the subtle energies around us. But the heart's power goes beyond mere electrical impulses. The heart math researchers have also discovered that the heart possesses its own intrinsic nervous system, a complex network of neurons and neurotransmitters that allow it to process information and make decisions independently of the brain. In essence, the heart is a highly sophisticated sensory organ, constantly scanning and responding to the environment around us. This means that when we talk about following our heart or trusting our gut, we're not just speaking in metaphors, we're actually tapping into a powerful source of intelligence and guidance that goes beyond the rational mind. What's more, the heart's electromagnetic field has been shown to have a profound impact on our mental, emotional, and physical well-being. When we experience positive emotions like love, gratitude, and appreciation, the heart's rhythms become more coherent and harmonious, sending signals of calm and balance to the rest of the body. In contrast, negative emotions like anger, fear, and stress create chaotic and erratic heart rhythms, leading to a cascade of harmful effects on our health and well-being. This is why practices like meditation, yoga, and mindfulness have been shown to have such powerful healing effects by helping us cultivate positive emotional states and coherent heart rhythms. They're literally rewiring our bodies and minds for greater resilience, vitality, 
and well-being. But perhaps the most exciting implication of the heart math research is the idea that by consciously cultivating positive emotions and coherent heart rhythms, we can not only transform our own lives, but also contribute to the healing and evolution of the planet as a whole. Through the phenomenon of global coherence, the collective heart energy of humanity has the power to shape the very fields of the earth itself creating a more harmonious and balanced world for all. This is where the power of the heart becomes truly awe-inspiring. By learning to harness the incredible energy and intelligence of our hearts, we're not just improving our own lives, we're actually participating in the evolution of human consciousness and the healing of the planet. If you're feeling inspired by the heart's incredible potential and eager to hear some practical tips, click the like button and subscribe. Now, I'll teach you practical techniques for cultivating heart coherence and tapping into the wisdom of the heart in your daily life. Heart-focused breathing. One of the simplest and most effective ways to cultivate heart coherence is through the practice of heart-focused breathing. To begin, find a comfortable seated position and place your hand on your heart. Close your eyes and take a few deep, slow breaths, imagining that you are breathing in and out through your heart center. As you inhale, visualize a warm, golden light filling your heart and expanding throughout your entire body. As you exhale, imagine any stress, tension or negativity leaving your body and dissipating into the air around you. Continue this practice for five to 10 minutes, allowing your breath to become smooth, even and effortless. As you focus your attention on your heart and breath, you may begin to notice a subtle shift in your emotional state. The simple act of bringing awareness to your heart center can help to activate the body's natural relaxation response, releasing tension and promoting a sense of calm and well-being. This is because the heart and the breath are intimately connected. When we're stressed or anxious, our breathing becomes shallow and rapid and our heart rate becomes erratic. But by consciously slowing and deepening our breath, we're sending a signal to our heart and nervous system that it's safe to relax and let go. But the benefits of heart-focused breathing go beyond mere stress relief. By consciously directing the flow of energy and attention to your heart, you are also strengthening the neural pathways between your heart and brain allowing for greater communication and coherence between these two vital centers of intelligence. In fact, research has shown that regular practice of heart-focused breathing can actually increase the synchronization between the heart and the brain, leading to improved cognitive function, emotional regulation, and overall well-being. So the next time you're feeling stressed, anxious, or overwhelmed, Try taking a few minutes to practice heart-focused breathing. You might be surprised at how quickly you can shift your state and tap into a deeper sense of peace and clarity. Cultivating positive emotions. Another key practice for achieving heart coherence is the cultivation of positive emotions like love, gratitude, and appreciation. Research has shown that when we experience these emotions, our heart rhythms become more coherent and harmonious, sending signals of calm and balance to the rest of the body and brain. One simple way to cultivate positive emotions is through the practice of gratitude journaling. Each day, take a few minutes to write down three things you are grateful for, no matter how small or seemingly insignificant. As you focus your attention on the blessings in your life, you may find that your perspective begins to shift and you start to notice more and more things to be thankful for. This practice is so powerful because it helps to rewire our brains for positivity and resilience. By consciously focusing on the good in our lives, 
we're training our minds to seek out and savor the positive rather than dwelling on the negative. Another powerful technique is the practice of loving kindness meditation. To begin, find a comfortable seated position and take a few deep breaths. Bring to mind someone you love and care about deeply and silently repeat the following phrases. May you be happy. May you be healthy. May you be safe. May you live with ease. Feel the warmth and sincerity of your words and imagine your love and compassion flowing out to this person in waves of healing energy. Next, extend this practice to someone you feel neutral about and finally, to someone you find challenging or difficult. With each repetition, feel your heart expanding and your capacity for love and understanding growing deeper and more expansive. As you cultivate positive emotions through practices like gratitude and loving kindness, you are not only improving your own well-being, but also contributing to the collective field of human consciousness. By radiating love and positivity into the world around you, you are helping to create a more harmonious and compassionate global community. Heart-Brain Coherence Meditation This powerful meditation technique developed by the HeartMath Institute is designed to synchronize the activity of the heart and brain, creating a state of deep coherence and inner harmony. To begin, find a quiet place where you won't be disturbed and sit comfortably with your eyes closed. Place your attention on your heart center and imagine breathing in and out through this area, as in the heart-focused breathing technique. As you continue to breathe, silently repeat a positive affirmation or intention that resonates with you, such as, I am at peace, or I am filled with love and compassion. Allow these words to sink deep into your heart, feeling their truth and power on a visceral level. Now imagine a beam of light extending from your heart center up to your brain, connecting these two vital organs in a circuit of flowing energy. See this light growing brighter and more radiant with each breath until your entire body is filled with a sense of warmth, ease, and inner harmony. As you rest in this state of heart-brain coherence, you may find that your mind becomes quieter and more still, and that insights and intuitions arise spontaneously from the depths of your being. Trust in the wisdom of your heart and allow yourself to be guided by its gentle promptings and inner knowing. With regular practice of the heart-brain coherence meditation, you may find that you are able to access states of deep peace, creativity, and intuitive wisdom more easily and consistently, even in the face of life's challenges and stressors. You may also notice a greater sense of connection and empathy with others, as your heart's electromagnetic field begins to resonate with the fields of those around you, fostering a sense of unity and shared purpose. Comment below which of these meditations and techniques you're going to practice first. The idea that the heart is a center of wisdom, intuition, and spiritual power is not a new one. For centuries, mystics, philosophers, and spiritual teachers have pointed to the heart as the seat of the soul, the gateway to higher consciousness and divine connection. In the Upanishads, a collection of ancient Sanskrit texts that form the basis of Vedantic philosophy, the heart is described as the cave of the heart, a secret chamber where the divine spark of the self resides. The Upanishads teach that by turning our attention inward and meditating on the heart, we can access a state of pure awareness and unity with the ultimate reality. The Chandogya Upanishad, one of the oldest Upanishadic texts, contains a beautiful passage that speaks to the heart's hidden power. As great as the infinite space beyond, 
is the space within the lotus of the heart. Both heaven and earth are contained in that inner space. Both fire and air, sun and moon, lightning and stars. Whether we know it or not, everything is contained in that inner space. This passage suggests that the heart is not just a physical organ, but a microcosm of the entire universe, containing within it all the wisdom, beauty, and mystery of creation itself. Similarly, in the Sufi tradition of Islamic mysticism, the heart is seen as the organ of spiritual perception, the eye of the heart that can perceive the divine essence in all things. Sufi poets and mystics often speak of the heart as a mirror that reflects the beauty and majesty of the divine, and of the spiritual journey as a process of polishing this mirror through the practices of love, devotion, and self-purification. The great Sufi poet Rumi writes, Your task is not to seek for love, but merely to seek and find all the barriers within yourself that you have built against it. For Rumi and other Sufi mystics, the path to divine love is not outward, but inward, a journey of the heart that requires us to confront and dissolve all the veils and illusions that separate us from our true nature. In the Buddhist tradition, the heart is associated with the quality of bodhicitta, or awakened heart, a state of unconditional love and compassion for all beings. The cultivation of bodhicitta is seen as the key to spiritual awakening and the realization of our inherent Buddha nature. The Buddhist sage Shanti Deva writes, For as long as space endures and for as long as living beings remain, until then may I too abide to dispel the misery of the world. This beautiful aspiration speaks to the boundless compassion of the awakened heart which seeks to alleviate the suffering of all beings, without exception. What is remarkable is that these ancient spiritual teachings are now being validated and expanded upon by the findings of modern science. The research of the HeartMath Institute and other pioneering organizations is revealing that the heart is not just a metaphorical symbol of love and wisdom, but a literal powerhouse of energy and intelligence with the capacity to shape our individual and collective reality in profound ways. By combining the timeless wisdom of the spiritual traditions with the cutting-edge insights of modern science, we have the opportunity to tap into a new level of understanding and mastery of the heart's power we can learn to cultivate heart coherence, emotional balance, and intuitive wisdom, not just as a means of personal growth and well-being, but as a way of contributing to the healing and transformation of our world. As we awaken to the true potential of the heart, we are also awakening to our own deepest nature as beings of love, compassion, and unity. We are remembering that we are not separate from the world around us, but intimately connected to all of life, part of a vast web of consciousness and energy that spans the entire cosmos. By learning to live from the heart, we are aligning ourselves with the very pulse of creation, the heartbeat of the universe itself. We are stepping into our birthright as co-creators of a new world, a world of peace, harmony, and unconditional love. So let us take these teachings and practices to heart and begin the journey of awakening to our true potential as beings of light and love. Let us become the change we wish to see in the world, one heart at a time. As we come to the end of our exploration of the heart's incredible power and potential, I want to leave you with a few final thoughts and inspirations to take with you on your journey. First and foremost, remember that the power of the heart is not some abstract or esoteric concept, but a very real and tangible force that you can access and cultivate in your own life. By practicing the techniques of heart coherence, emotional balance, and intuitive wisdom that we've explored in this video, you are not only improving your own well-being, 
but also contributing to the collective healing and evolution of our world. But the journey of the heart is not always an easy one. It requires courage, vulnerability, and a willingness to face the shadows and challenges that inevitably arise on the path of growth and transformation. It means being willing to let go of old patterns and beliefs that no longer serve us and to embrace the unknown with an open and curious heart. Yet the rewards of this journey are beyond measure. As we learn to live from the heart, we tap into a source of infinite love, wisdom and creativity that can transform every aspect of our lives. We become more authentic, compassionate and empowered, able to navigate life's challenges with grace and resilience. We also begin to see the world in a new light, recognizing the inherent beauty, goodness, and interconnectedness of all things. We become more attuned to the needs and struggles of others and more inspired to be of service in whatever way we can. Whether it's through small acts of kindness and generosity or through larger efforts to create positive change in our communities and the world at large, the power of the heart can ripple out in endless ways, touching and transforming lives in ways we may never even know. One beautiful example of this is the story of Megan Snyder, a young woman who suffered from a rare and debilitating heart condition. Despite her physical challenges, Megan was determined to live a life of purpose and compassion using her own struggles as a catalyst to help others. She began volunteering at a local hospital, offering support and encouragement to other patients facing similar challenges. She also started a blog and social media presence, sharing her story and inspiring others to find hope and meaning in the face of adversity. As Megan's message of love and resilience spread, she began to receive messages from people all over the world who had been touched by her story. Many of them shared their own experiences of hardship and healing and expressed gratitude for the light and inspiration that Megan had brought into their lives. Despite her own physical limitations, Megan had tapped into the power of her heart to create a ripple effect of love and compassion that extended far beyond her immediate circle. She had become a living example of the transformative potential of the human spirit and a beacon of hope for all those who were struggling. Megan's story is just one of countless examples of the power of the heart in action. Each and every one of us has the capacity to make a difference in the world simply by living from a place of love, compassion and authenticity. So as you go forward from here, I invite you to make the journey of the heart a central part of your life's path. Trust in the wisdom and guidance of your own heart and let it lead you towards your highest purpose and deepest fulfillment. Remember that you are not alone on this journey, but part of a global community of heart-centered beings who are all working towards a more loving, just and sustainable world. Together, we have the power to create a new paradigm of human existence, one that is based on the principles of compassion, unity and respect for all life. May your heart be your guide, your compass and your source of infinite strength and inspiration. May you always know that you are loved, supported and cherished by the very fabric of the universe itself. And may you use the incredible power of your heart to create a life and a world that is truly worthy of your highest vision and deepest love. Thank you for joining me on this journey of the heart. May it be just the beginning of a lifelong adventure of growth, discovery and transformation. And may the power of your heart continue to shine brightly, illuminating the way for all who are blessed to know you.